So, and welcome back to another session of Reynolds Monday. Alright, so, we got the shock, we are now engaged to the lovely girl. I do not want to run into my monster-in-law again, <laughs> so maybe later. Maybe later. Alright, we need to go and check on Matt. Can't reach it. Uh, maybe with the. There we go. I should patent this thing. It's the best. All right. Is there anything new in the subway? No. This seems fine. All right. We need to go and check on Matt. There's the snot kid again. <laughs> hey there, big guy. What a cool balloon you have there. It's mine. You can't have it. You, you suck. suck. Uh, here's a tip. You shouldn't go around insulting people. You're ugly. Especially if your mom's not with you to protect you. You're ugly and stupid. Whatever, kid. I warned you. Is that a threat, jerk face? Yes. Yeah, it's just a warning. Well, it sounded like a threat to me, so apologize. Uh, no. Ah! Say you're sorry, you monkey face. Ah! Okay, okay, I'm sorry. That's better, douchebag. Hmm. I don't want your stupid balloon. Uh, I don't want your stupid balloon. Oh, uh, not again. Oh, not again. You're really trying my patience. You're really trying my patience. You wanna play tough, huh? You wanna play tough, huh? Three switched witches watch three swatch watch switches. Which switched witch watches which swatch watch switch? Um, you stink. All right, I'm off before I catch something from you. All right, uh, let's talk to the hot dog vendor. Hey, good morning. Good morning. Would you like a balloon? Sure. Are they free? Do I look like the kind of guy who give away a free balloon? I don't know. Didn't you used to sell hot dogs? Ah, I'm afraid that's all ancient history now. There was a time when the hot dog goddesses smiled on me. I used to have the best dogs in town. But one fateful day, I got this hex on me. And since then... Hey, hold it, pal. I got the monopoly on curses. Find yourself another excuse. I'm sorry? I said I want a hot dog with extra everything. Did you not hear a word that I just said? What? Ugh, I hate people. That makes two of us. So, uh... What can I do to get a few free balloons? What can I do to get a few free balloons? Well, you could kill me, I guess. Well, don't you think that's a little drastic? About as drastic as you wanting me to just hand over a free balloon. You can either pay for it or kill me and take one. It's your choice. Well, I wasn't really planning on killing anybody. Smart kid. Is that a helium cylinder? How else am I going to blow up the balloons? How should I know? You're the expert. <laughs> and I'm telling you, it's helium. Then why isn't your voice all high-pitched and stuff? What planet do you live on? That's only if you inhale it. Are you sure? Because that's not what I've heard. As sure as today is Monday. Okay, then, uh, why don't you prove it? Because I don't want to waste my helium. Oh, come on. Don't make me beg. You can beg all you want. I'm not going to inhale some helium just to give you a cheap laugh. Aw. Please. No. Please. No. Please, please. No, no, no. no. Please, please, please. No, no, no. Pretty please. I said no. Super please. Really? <laughs> super, super please. Don't insist. I really need it. Do you want me to tell you what I need? Yes. I really, really need it. I really, really don't care. 
I really, really need it desperately. That sounds familiar. Uh, it's a matter of life and death? Then I choose death. If you don't do it, I won't talk to you ever again. Thank God. Where do I sign? I'll be your best friend. I already have a dog. I'll be your best friend forever. I hate dogs. Don't you want to be my friend? <laughs> Great stuff. And I think the kid liked it, too. Well, that's only normal. He's just a kid. But you? Yeah. Hey, uh, can you do it again? No. You know I'm not going to do it again. Alright, fine. <laughs> Morning pizza! Oh, why so early? Because I was awake. <laughs> and I wanted to actually be able to finish this game sometime soon so I can start on something new. I love this game, but I'm feeling like I want to do something new. Can we take the stool? Yeah. So if I can't, it's cancelled. Kid, what the hell do you think you're doing? Touching um, it? Nothing. Then don't touch that valve. Ma. Can't open it, it's locked. I've never knocked on this door before. Hmm. Hmm. I can't open it. It's locked. Hmm. Hmm. I can't do Okay. Let's see, what does the hint says I off to do? If Matt's still alive, we gotta find and explain it all to him. If you know him well, okay. He's not going to be in this apartment then, then he's going to be at Clayton's cave. Up the radio now. Yeah, nice. Might need it for something else. Still pretty early. The bar's still closed. Hmm. All right. Go to Charlie's Comics then. Hello, guys. Hey, what's up, fellas? Fellas, who the fuck are you? Easy, dude. I was just wondering what you guys were doing here. We don't even know you, dude. Get the fuck out of here. What's with the attitude? What's with the attitude? Look, we don't trust total strangers, right? You could be a fucking cop or something. Come on, do I look like a cop to you? I don't know, but cops are just everywhere. Well, believe me, I'm no cop. What do you think, man? Okay, we trust you. So what the fuck do you want? Oh, nothing. I was just curious. Well, curiosity killed the cat, dude. Well, I'm not a cat, so what are you guys doing here? Business, man. All business. It's just that, well, you, know, you totally look like a couple of dealers. So what? Oh, nothing. I mean, it's just, what are you guys selling? Shit, everything but coke, heroin, and our asses. Okay. Snoogins! <laughs> I should have seen your face, man. Oh, yeah. Hilarious. We're selling contraband Captain Red masks. Really? Where'd you get them from? Well, that fuckhole who runs a comic store left a box full of them in his fucking car. All we had to do was break the glass and boom, take them. <laughs> and what do you want them for? Hey, that's a whole lot of questions for someone who isn't a cop, dude. Look, this year is supposed to be the 35th anniversary of fucking Captain Red. So we figured, boom, there's got to be a bunch of dumb fucks out there who'll get a hard on for this kind of shit. Well, I'm not sure. You know, that show has been going downhill for quite some time now. The sales just completely suck. 
Fuck that little fuckhole fucking Captain Red, dude. We're going for the nostalgia factor. Believe me, there are tons of little pussies in this town who are dying to have one of these masks no matter the cost. If you say so. Can I have one of those? A mask? Like, I don't know, man. You, you look like a guy who's gonna be a pain in my balls. You shouldn't judge people before you get to know them. You guys are a good example. Hey, what the fuck is that supposed to mean? Nothing. I'm just saying you guys look like a couple of drug dealers in those costumes. But then I talked to you and saw that you don't deal drugs. You just deal other stuff. Yo, you got any cash? Not even a dime. Then what the fuck, dude? <laughs> Shit, if you ain't got no fucking money. Why should we keep wasting our time with you? Because your friend is not talking and you miss having someone to chat to. You're right, man. This fat bastard really drives me up the wall sometimes with his not speaking ass. What, you have a problem? I'm just speaking the truth here, sir. Oh, man, this is so boring. I wish there was something to keep us entertained for a while. And isn't it ironic that you always go around with a silent guy? Well, I never gave it any thought, buddy. Whatever. Uh, so, about those masks, why don't you just give me the first one for free? Isn't that how it usually works with you dealers? Who the fuck do you think we are, man? Um... Uh, do you have any Guy Fox or Predator masks? Oh, mm, uh, let me check if there's any left in the back. Dude, come on, man. Where the hell do you think you are? Fucking Walmart? I told you, we just have Captain Red masks. Okay, okay. Gotcha. gotcha. Uh, do you need any help? Do we look like we need your help? Well, I guess not. Uh, yeah, that's right, man, because we could take care of ourselves. <laughs> your buddy's kind of a silent guy, isn't he? Oh, this little fuck? He's just playing his role, but you know, I'm kind of a party guy, and all this silence is starting to make me feel a little, uh, uneasy and shit. <clears throat> Say something, you little fat fuck, anything! See? This son of a bitch really gets on my fucking nerves, but I love him at the same time, in a totally heterosexual way, of course. Right. Man, what can I say? <laughs> this storyline, though. Yeah, That's I know. Secret, man. Without respect, this friendship would never have stood the test. Well, you're a role model for us all. That's for sure. I've been having some problems with my best friend lately, too. Well, nothing good could come out of that, man. Friendship is like a plant. You gotta water from time to time, or else it'll end up withering. Yeah, well, uh, I can guess what kind of plants you're talking about. You have a bad mind, man, and that's beyond my expertise. <laughs> Have you, uh, seen this weird guy with glasses and a green shirt around? No, that doesn't ring any bells, but maybe it's just because I never focus my attention on guys. Okay, so, uh... Fine. You guys to it. See ya. See you around, bud. Snooch. Yeah, sure. Snooch. That's still going strong with the singing. Hello, Charlie. Hey, what's up, Charlie? You look a little bummed out. Oh, kill me, Randall. I can't take that fucking song anymore. Have you tried unplugging it? Have you tried it? unplugging it? Yes, but it won't stop. It looks like someone broke in last night and messed up my security system. Just like they messed up Krypton. Well, what did they take? Everything looks kind of normal. They took the super hot chick lingerie special from 1972. Whoever did it, they knew what they were doing. Oh, damn. I heard that one's worth a fortune, right? Ah, uh, don't worry, I have insurance. It's that song that's driving me up the wall. I can't make it stop. And the technician won't be here until tomorrow. Well, hang in there, man. Aw, poor guy. I know I keep saying this, but I do like that song. Well, you have terrible taste in music. I'd kick you right in the nuts if I wasn't considering ripping my ears off to make that fucking noise stop. Come on, Charlie. It's a classic. Just loosen up and try and enjoy it. Da, 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 da. Catchy, right? Not really, no. Please. I'm sorry, Charlie, but I don't need any more corpses on my hands. Then leave me alone with my misery. Have uh, you seen Matt today? No. Why? Did you guys fight over who would make the better-looking woman again? I told you, Matt has classic womanly features. No, that's not it. Matt got all drunk and now he's on the loose. And it's all my fault. There's a chance I did something really bad to him. Oh shit. Then you know how it's gonna end. The cops will probably have to put him down with a dart. Oh, relax. Everything's gonna be okay <laughs> because like I'm gonna up. find him before yeah, he does something that stupid. Yeah, should also be true, oh, actually. Perfect. I'll see you guys on the news tonight. Well, you look kinda busy. I'll see you later.
Oh, and there we go. Just outside. That is one annoying sound though. Alright, nothing there. Let's go to the pawn pawn shop then. I don't want looks like Mel drank all of his cans before they went off. Uh-huh. Hello. Mel? Hello? Welcome, Father Roy. When, when did you start talking? What the hell is wrong what with you? What the hell is wrong with you? You look dumber than ever. Mm -hmm. I think that would be a serious case of mercury poisoning. Yeah, that'd be it. Wait a second. Did you drink the entire stash of mercury cola? It's the very last drop. And the fridge broke. So I had to drink them all. But why? Do you want to die? Did you find out you have some kind of weird incurable disease or something? What? I said, why have you given up on life, Mel? Uh, hello? Can I help you? <laughs> yes, uh, I'd like a can of mercury cola, please. Sure. Oh, wait a sec. I'm all out. Did I? Did Good morning, I... Sal. Okay, I'm gonna die for sure. Wall A is I'm what? So damn high, I don't really care. I don't think you can help me in this condition. I'm out of here. Uh -huh. Alright, anything special we can take? I do. There's so much. Can I take the Buster Sword? I can't. I the rollerblades. Notebook. No. The yank. Yeah, there's so much stuff I wouldn't know what to choose. Yeah, well, here it's uh, nine twenty-one a.m. Right, nothing we can take otherwise. Oh, it doesn't seem I like don't... it. Man, it. Hmm. I don't think that's it. I want to hold on to Besides, I don't have time to be delivering packages. I have to go find that four-eyed maniac before he blows up this whole town. Okay. Where did my mouse point go? There we go. Alright, um... I don't... Cans, trash cans full of trash. Hmm. Can we go in through the back door? I can't. Nope. It's still. Okay, I have no clue. Ah, all right. We're going to pick the lock again. Walls a wall, yes. Let's see, we should have the business card there. Crap, I broke the card. I guess I'll have to find another way to get in. Matt, you there? Hey! What's with all the yelling? If you're looking for Matthew, I'm afraid you're too late. What do you mean? I saw him leaving five minutes ago. He was completely wasted and he said he was going to the bar for some more. That kid is beyond help. Let's not start judging people by their acts. Then how do we judge <laughs> people? I don't know. By their looks? Fine. Okay. He's down at the bar now. We stole his girlfriend. 
Father Roy is here as usual. 